The chain of events between planting a crop and putting food on the table is highly complex. Planting the right crop in the right soil, protecting it from pests, harvesting it at the right time all take a lot of coordination. It's easy to see how AI can help improve this process. Hummingbird Technologies is an artificial intelligence business for farming. They use imagery from satellites and drones to help farms solve complex problems in their fields. Through data analysis, they're able to tell a farmer if they're using too much fertilizer, which saves them money and the environment. Alex, farmers are operating on such razor thin margins. It's always a struggle to turn a profit. How are you helping them reduce costs? We have two product lines. We have a fresh produce product line, which is drone based. And effectively, the product there is the reduction of chemicals. So last year, last season, we and for our customers, we reduced costs by around 100 pounds per hectare. Doesn't seem that much, but when you scale up into tens of thousands, you're talking, it's significant. And um, whilst also increasing their yields, so you're getting more you know, pound per hectare as well when you're selling to whoever your end user is. So we do that, and then we also have a satellite-based product which is all about monitoring the sequestration of carbon. You know, so farmers allowing them to monetize their land effectively. Okay. So How does that work? The Regen Ag has core products such as no-till farming, um, crop rotation, cover crops, and this helps carbon, store carbon in, in, in the soil. We monitor that. We work with carbon credit programs, for example, okay. who sign up the farmer. We verify that they farmed in a regenerative manner, and then they get, you know, on, I think it's around 40 to $50 per, per hectare. So, you know, it's quite a significant sum. So when you add up the savings per hectare and fertilizer production plus yeah. the carbon offset, it becomes it, very significant. It's trying to enable farmers to monetize their land mass without just the traditional ways of, hey, we grow salad crops and we're going to sell to the, you know, to supermarkets. Water is the next frontier. We've already got global challenges with water scarcity. What does the roadmap look like for Hummingbird Technologies to help conquer that problem? At the moment, via satellites, it's, it's, it's quite complicated. But we expect working with partners across the globe working with the NASA's, the ESA's, the JASA's of this world. We're developing products that will help farmers irrigate in a more efficient manner, for example. You know, that's a sort of crucial one of how much water is used right. and wasted. What can governments do to incentivize farmers further to start adopting these technologies that seem so important for the future sustainability of the planet? Well, changing from a chemical intensive manner of farming towards a regen farming is not, it's not an overnight process. Let's be clear about that. So. If you effectively pay farmers to do it, you are looking after the future, you know, all of our futures, um, and ensuring that they don't they don't get hit financially right. and too hurt over the process of doing it. That's what it is effectively. It's an insurance policy, if you like. And there's so many different vendors you've had to integrate with, and farmers are again in that same topic, being pulled in so many different directions from manufacturers. Mm. How have you been able to integrate so easily and make your platform work across all those manufacturers? Well, first and foremost, we're a software business. We have an API, so quite simply, we integrate we integrate via the back end with all these with all these manufacturers and suppliers, and and, and indeed some of our customers. What do the customers then see uh, from the Hummingbird platform? They see their land. Uh, they get. They get reports on the quality on the quality of their farming, for example. They get application maps so they can, um, in the case of fresh produce, vegetables, they can go out, we can fly a drone, we, we analyze it, we put it onto the platform. Farmers can go out the next day with their tractor, with their sprayer, and have a bespoke targeted application map that will reduce effectively their chemicals and ensure no wastage. And so is that where the improvement in yield happens? Targeting each lettuce with bespoke applications means that you mitigate any yield loss as well as increasing the yield. So you get a double positive on that effectively.